Welcome back, family. Welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Sir Local 187. And uh, today is February 10th. Excuse the, the hair. I'm just getting out of work. The grind don't stop. And uh, today I hit on um, the Air Jordan 1 Low Concords. And uh, sheesh, I hit on a DTLR uh, raffle. I did put in a raffle for a, uh, the Air Jordan 1 Low Concords. Uh, I know y'all heard me talking about them. For those of y'all that have been following me uh, a couple of weeks ago. And... Uh, Man, shout out to DTLR, they're showing me some love. So I also hit on the Air Jordan 4 Crafts in my size and a GS pair at DTLR. So shout out to DTLR, baby. You know how we do it around here. Sheesh. We got to keep the momentum going. So anyway, Jordan Brand's taking my money. But anyway, I want to bring you all the, you know what I'm saying, the, the, the highest reviews of the latest and greatest sneakers. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, with that being said, let me go pick up these J's and we'll get a closer look at of these bad boys, okay? All right. All right, family. So we're back at the lab. Uh, just got done uh, getting home. Just got finished coming home. And, uh, you know, like I said, I picked up the Air Jordan 1 uh, Low Concord SC. Uh, it's been a been pretty busy you know it's been heating up uh i know i've been trying to stay active in the for the month of january i did cop a couple sneakers in january and whatnot but uh yeah these now the main ingredient is the air jordan one low se is a special edition concord okay and it's pretty much a black and white silhouette now they they released them first on on a um, nike app if, if i'm not mistaken uh like two three weeks ago something like that you know so uh, you know, they're finally, uh, you know, released elsewhere. You know what I mean? So drop a comment. Let your boy know if y'all went for them. Uh, if y'all took L's, W's, or or they might be on the may, may, maybe to cop list or whatever the case may be. But uh, I think they should be, uh, you know, they should be leftover pairs. You know what I'm saying? Because I know Hibbits had raffles from, like I said. I don't know why they were raffled off. You know what I'm saying? Whatever the case may be. But. Uh, check your habits uh, and uh, also to your DTLRs and maybe your Foot Locker and your Champs, you know what I'm saying, uh, later on down the road, you know what I'm saying, because they were on the FLX app, but not for a raffle, okay, so for those of y'all that are interested, I took else or are thinking about copying this, this particular sneaker, so real quick to the new family members, you know, I did uh, cop, uh, give me a second here. I did cop this at DTLR, for those of y'all that missed the video, it's the Air Jordan 4 Seafoam, it's a woman's exclusive, and uh, I did catch these on a leftover day on release day, you know what I'm saying, and I explained all that in the, in, in the video, in the review that I did for this, okay, I, and I copped this at uh, DTLR, but I took owls as far as like the raffles and online and all that other stuff, okay. So, like I mentioned, you know what I'm saying, I'm on my way to pick up, uh, not on my way, but tomorrow, uh, God willing, everything works out, I'll be go, going to pick up those Air Jordan 4 crafts, you know what I'm saying, I want to get them in hand and see, see, you know what I'm saying, see what they're looking like, you know, see how they feel in my fingertips, you know what I'm saying. So anyway, welcome to new family members, uh, we're on the way to 1K, we're about like at 966, so if this is your first time watching one of my videos, or you've been watching one, you know, my videos and haven't sub subscribed yet, by all means, please consider subscribing. It'll go a long way, especially if you're into sneakers. Okay, now, this Air Jordan 1 Low Concord SE, they did do a family size run. I, I believe they have GS pairs, and they have, like, uh, I think preschool, if I'm not mistaken. But they are uh, kid size as well, too. And uh, they retail for $120, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, if I didn't already mention that. And they released today, as the day of this recording, February 10. Like I said, the grind don't stop, okay? So, um, there's going to be a lot of, a lot of heat dropping. Like I said, finally, uh, sneakers, because I, I hit on a shock drop on the Air Jordan uh, 13 playoff. So, they'll be shipping them. Uh, I should be getting them hopefully mid next week. You know what I'm saying? So, look out for that review. I know y'all seen a bunch of videos out there of the playoff 13s, but y'all ain't seen a certain local video. So, you definitely want to stay uh, tuned in and make sure you turn in that notification bell. So when your boy Sword Loco is cooking in the kitchen, and you know your boy's got to stay cooking in the kitchen, y'all be the first ones to come and get it, okay? So that's the main ingredient, enough of my blabbering, and uh, let's get to it. Okay. 
there it is. Air Jordan 1 Low SE Special Edition. Hoo, 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 hoo. Black and white colorway. Say hello to my little friend right there. Okay, and I also did a video too, like a little try on haul for this uh, particular sweater. For all you that are new, go to the playlist and check it out. There goes the goats. Okay, so we'll get with the box. All right, love it. You got the gloss with the matte black. Okay, finish. You got the Air Jordan basketball wings. And let me shut the light off here. See if we get a better, better reading. Air Jordan 1 Low SC Special Edition. And it's white and black, y'all. Sheesh, who would have known? <laughs> All right, so anyway, let's look inside. Stamp action there, as you can see. All right. And let's see if there's any YDM. And there isn't any YDM. Okay, so that's enough. Enough of that, okay? So we'll just talk about the materials. And I'm, I'm just curious, y'all, because, you know, is Jordan Brand giving us uh, like a like a prelude? Or, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and they they drop kind of like in a pack. Okay, I just bust these out real quick. These are the Space Jam uh, mids, Air Jordan One mids, Space Jam, and these are the Concord ones. Pretty much, you could pretty much say a pack. Okay, I did do a review for these. If you haven't checked it out, go check it out. But Real quick, I'm wondering if they're doing a prelude because, uh, you know, they confirmed that they're going to drop the DMP uh, Air Jordan 11s, which pretty much is a Concord colorway with the exception of, uh, you know, Gold Jumpman on it, you know what I'm saying, on, on, the, on the DMP 11s. And they're saying that instead of the ballistic mesh upper, it's going to be a leather upper. But, you know, like I said, you know, the Jordan brand giving us a hint to, to us to come, you know what I'm saying, these are the Concords. And those DMP, you know what I'm saying, um, Define, Defining Moments pack, which dropped some years back, uh, you know, there is pretty much a Concord colorway, which just except it had a gold jump, man, you know what I'm saying? But going back to these, the Space Jams, are they going to drop a Space Jam 11 or something similar to it later on this year? I don't know. That was just a crazy thought that crossed my mind, you know what I'm saying? Y'all drop a comment, let me know what y'all think. So anyway, let me get these out of here. You're not going to steal the shine of these Air Jordan 1 Lows. Peter Moore, you already know, designed Air Jordan 1. Okay, this is not an OG because the OG will have the Nike Air on the on the tongue. This has a Jumpman. You got your nylon kind of like a ballistic mesh tongue. Okay, it comes with one lace, white. You got your perforated hole. So the materials is leather genuine leather and of course your patent leather okay so you got your perforated holes there and you got your white side side panels in genuine leather okay smooth and same thing with the lateral smooth okay as you can see the patent leather now the story goes when they were making Air Jordan 11 that, you know, Michael Jordan wanted wanted some shine on his shoe. You know what I'm saying? So that's how they came out with the patent leather, you know, on the Air Jordan 11. You know, he was wondering, hey, can we get some of that stuff on a sneaker? And sure enough, it was ahead of their time, and it sure did do it. You got the Air Jordan basketball wing. We'll go to the heel part, and it's stitched on. Okay. As you can see, the white and black there. How it... It blends in with the side panels of the white leather. But the patent leather, it's classy. You know what I'm saying? That's what Jordan brand, you know, like if you look at all their, most of their silhouettes, whether we like them or not, you know, besides uh, it being a performing shoe for the most part, for most silhouettes, uh, a couple of silhouettes, you know, they focus more on the aesthetics, you know, the looks. But with patent leather, I mean, shoot, uh, when uh, those of y'all go to weddings and this and that, I mean, you, your uh, your dress shoes, you know, are, are either patent leather or just some shiny, shiny glossed up leather, and it looks like class, class and elegance, and that's why 
even with Air Jordan 11s or anything patent leather, depending on the color, you know, people wear it to their weddings, uh, wear it to special occasions, and you can get away with that, in my opinion. That's what patent leather, you know what I'm saying, it looks. It, 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 you know, some people might disagree. Some people, you know, like I said, not patent leather ain't for everybody, but it is on dress shoes, okay? So that's why many people wear it. You know what I'm saying? I, I, like I said, weddings or just special occasions. It's, it's classy. It's clean. Okay? And uh, in the midsole, you got the white midsole. You do have an encapsulated, you know what I'm saying, air unit, if I'm not mistaken, all throughout the midsole. Okay? So, I mean, you've seen one. You've see, done seen them all. But that's what you have, a patent leather and uh, white, white genuine leather. Two basic colorways. You could dress it up and dress it down however you want. You can wear these with jogging pants or you can wear these with a suit. You know, it's up to you. And I do love the icy bottoms. Icy translucent bottoms. You got your stars there. You can barely see it. You got your famous Air Jordan 1 traction. Your pivot deal there. The circle. Okay. You got your Nike Air in the bottom. But I, I, I'm digging this translucent outsole. Drop a comment. Let your boy know what y'all think. Y'all digging the translucent icy blue also? Let me know. Okay. So let's look at the manufacturing date. Okay. It says 6 22 22 9 15 22 22. Okay. Y'all can see it. Oh, and also, too, it came with the paper instead of the shoe trees. Okay, um, now I tried taking out the insole on these, and they put a lot of glue. They put a lot of glue, and uh, shoot, I almost ripped a little piece of the insole. So I just left them on there, because for those of y'all that have been watching me for a while, you already know I, I pretty much try to go in depth and, and take out the outsole. But with that purple Concord um, lettering says, it says Jumpman, Okay. Jump man. Okay. Or Jordan. J O R D O N. Okay. Jordan. Alright, so I mean that's pretty dope. You know what I'm saying? And Air Jordan eleven, for the all for those of y'all that have it, uh, you know what I'm saying? It it'll say that across Across the, you know what I'm saying, across the tongue, you know what I'm saying, right above the, uh, the, the, the toe box, if you will, you know what I'm saying, it has that, that, that lettering, you know what I'm saying, so it, it's pretty dope, it's pretty dope, I like it, I dig it, Jordan, that's what it says, yo, okay, so that's pretty dope, you know what I'm saying, like I said, overall, it's a solid, it's a solid one, in my opinion, it's pretty dope, and, uh, you know, I don't know, will they sell out, I know they sold out on the Nike, when they released them on the Nike app uh, a couple of weeks back right away, but, you know, now that you're having them in different parts of the, of the stores, I mean, I think they might sit for a little bit, but I don't think they'll sit for long, especially the bigger sizes, so if you're all thinking about copying, you know what I'm saying, check your local malls from here on out. See if they randomly drop drop them, you know, for those places that didn't have raffles. Uh, and I would try to snag these up pretty quick. Like I said, my, will they sit maybe, you know what I'm saying, a couple days. But I don't think these will sit for too long. And I'm talking about like the bigger sizes, you know what I'm saying, like sizes 9 and up. I don't think they'll sit for too long. Uh, the grade schools and the preschools, I mean, that, those should be pretty easy as well. But then again, hey, you know what I'm saying, the parents want to make sure that their kids are are uh dressing fly and, and wearing the latest and greatest kicks okay so that's pretty much it that's the air jordan one uh low spe se special edition concords and uh you know i give it a thumbs up you know what i'm saying i really like it i give it you know what i'm saying for what it is i'm not comparing it to nothing else but just for what it is the execution i give it a nine you know i just don't go for hype stuff you know what i mean so local can be a hype beast and try to get the hype stuff, but you know, as we all know, the hype stuff is hard to get. But I also do like what I like. I cop what I like. It doesn't have to be hype. 
or whatever the case may be or follow the trend you know what i'm saying like i say so i give these a nine out of ten like i said they're clean i ain't afraid to give a a good uh good rating on a, on a you know what i'm saying a regular general release if you will so anyway drop a comment let me know what you rate these would y'all cop them did y'all cop y'all pass y'all like patent leather y'all don't like patent leather whatever the case may be you know what i'm saying so anyway that's the main ingredient. You know, your boy can't cook without the special ingredient. That's every single one of y'all that's taking time out of your day to watch my videos. So until next time, you know what I'm saying? Make sure your notification bell's on because uh, your boy's got some more con content coming. So appreciate y'all. Have a good night.